Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Rishi Labs. In today's video, we will see how to download Oracle VirtualBox. So let's get started. For this, you will require a web browser. I'll make use of Google Chrome. In the address bar, you need to type Oracle VirtualBox download and press enter. You'll get the first link downloads Oracle VirtualBox. Okay, on this page, you will see there are several links available. You can download the setup file for Windows, Mac OS, Linux, as well as Solaris. So I'll select Windows host. So our setup file is getting downloaded. Once the setup file is downloaded, you'll click on open. You will get a pop up, select yes. I will close the web browser as we don't need it. Okay, so Oracle VirtualBox setup has started. On this, you need to click on select next. I accept the agreement. Click on next. Don't make any changes over here. We'll go with the default settings. If you want to change the installation directory, you can browse and change the directory. But I'll, but I'll keep it default. Click on next. You'll get net, a warning network interfaces. Proceed with installation now. Click on yes. Click on yes. This will create all the shortcuts. Click on next. Click on install. Now Oracle VirtualBox installation has started. This may take few minutes to get installed. Okay, so Oracle VirtualBox has got installed. I'll uncheck this. Click on finish. Okay. So how you can access Oracle VirtualBox, a desktop icon has got created. You can double click this icon. It will start the Oracle VirtualBox. Other ways you can click on Windows. Click in search type VirtualBox. And you will get the app icon. Click on Open. Okay. Now I will click on the Oracle VirtualBox. So this is the welcome screen. I will make it full screen. Okay. So what is this tool actually? Oracle VirtualBox is a free open source virtualization software developed by Oracle. It is free to use. Okay, It allows user to run multiple operating system in a single physical machine. Right now we have a single physical machine and Windows 11 is installed on it. Now if I want to test another operating system, if I want to install another operating system, Without uninstalling this Windows 11, I can make use of VirtualBox where I can create multiple virtual machines. Okay. And in that virtual machine, I can install different operating system. So each virtual machine which we create in the software operates as if it were a separate computer with its own operating system, storage and hardware resources. Okay. So in file, you can see there are different options preferences this is for the setting you can change the language update language and display settings are there now to create a new virtual machine you need to click on new over here you need to provide a name to it the folder where you want to create this virtual machine then the iso file iso file is the setup file of the operating system which you want to install it and select the type it is a windows microsoft windows operating system it is a linux okay type of image file you want to install and the versions okay and you can proceed so for now we have installed oracle virtual machine in upcoming videos we will see how to install any operating system with making use of oracle virtual box Okay, so I'll close this software for now.
that's all for today you can subscribe to my youtube channel rishi labs thanks for watching